Hey everyone, welcome to CG Studio YouTube channel. Today we are going to talk about, making simple wood material, and, save materials in Blender. So let's get started. I'm using the screencast add-on right here. Because you can display, keyboard keys at the right side corner. Click A to select all and press delete. Shift A, Mesh, and UV Sphere. Go to the modifiers and select Subdivision Surface Modifier. And set the value to 4. Simply go to the Shading tab. Click on New to create new material. And rename it. Shift plus A and search color ramp. And connect color to base color. Then, get the Noise Texture node and place it right here. I'm searching Google to get basic wood colors. Search adobe.color.com Adobe Color is the trusted way to get good colors to your project. Click on Explore and search with colors. I'm using these colors. You can choose better colors for make simple wood material. When you click on the color, its hex code will copy to your clipboard. So click on it, and open black color and go to hex and paste the hex code. I'm using another, darker color. Join factor to factor. Press Ctrl plus T for get texture coordinate. To get this shortcut go to Edit, Preferences, Add-ons and Search Node Wrangler Add-on. and put a tick on it and connect object to vector up the detail to 16 
and move this darker color right here and change the scale. Also change this y-axis scale. You can see a simple wood material right there. And also up the roughness value to 0 0.750. And get the bum node. Connect normal to normal and factor to height. down the scale value right here as you want. You can see a simple wood material. Go to the material properties and scroll down. You can see material library VX right there. To get this shortcut, again go to Edit, Preferences, Add-ons and search Material Library Add-on, and also put a tick on it. And open Material Library. Click on New Library. Type Material Collection. And here go to the new library you had saved. Make sure you had renamed the material, and also make sure to save material. and click Add to Library. And also delete this other materials. There are not needed.
Again save the project. Here I'm going to talk how to use material library and go to the same place when we go recently and select the collection. You can see your saved material right here and click apply to select it. And thanks for watching, every week I will upload a new tutorial, and see you on next day. Bye.